So I had a problem today with my um, anchor chain going between my bilge keel and my long keel, like this. Um, I'm using a rope here for demonstration purposes. But it went through and I rode over it basically and then came out here and then imagine that's the anchor up there. Um, which basically holds the boat sideways on this um, into the tide and the wind. I'll now show you how I got out of it. So first thing you want to do is tie a decent sized rope that can take the weight onto a back cleat. You could in theory use a forward cleat if you've got two bow rollers and two uh, cleats up there, but I was just at the back of the boat. I had ropes there ready, uh, that's the one I used. I then laid down on the deck and got the boat hook and I managed to hook this rope and just sort of pull it up to just below deck level with my arms hanging over the side. I then tied a rolling hitch. I put some extra loops in it just so it gives me some extra friction there and it holds pretty good on chain, not so good on this rope but on the chain it's really good. And then you can either just let this go just let it fall back into the water and you've got a loose rope going to the back then and a tight rope out to the anchor. So this is how it will be, you've got your rope cleated off at the back, it comes up to the anchor chain, still fairly loose, it's got the rolling hitch onto the anchor chain and this anchor chain is still got all the tension uh, which is hooked around your bilge plate still. That goes up there and still holding you sideways at this point. So now it's just a matter of sort of getting hold of it again, um, slackening off on the the normal anchor chain so that that then goes slack um, and you've got all your tension on the, the rope at the back on your rolling hitch and then you can just unhook the chain from the bows which is a bit nerve-wracking but you let it go, just throw it overboard, and then you can pull this in from in between your keels. And then it's just a matter of, once you get the end up, is run it around any rigging, you know, stanchions and all, sort of any other obstacles, back over the, the bow roller, and then back either over your windlass or your cleats or whatever you do to secure your normal anchor chain. And then it's just a matter of making your way back to wherever you've tied the rope off, whether it's your bow or like I did, like I say, I was at the stern, so I've got it tied off down there. Now on mine, it was just too tight to undo. So I got a big knife and just cut it there. 